So let's kind of start with the pros and the cons of the Terminator X, starting with the pros. Without a doubt, the number one pro is the price. Next up, most of the kits include a three and a half inch touchscreen display, and you can use this touchscreen display to run the quote unquote wizard to build you a startup tune. Another thing that Terminator X has is an internal map sensor. Next thing that the Terminator X has is it has diagnostic lights on the front of the ECU. This almost seems to do more harm than good as people get really concerned about these lights. You know, people will come to me with my lights are doing this, that, the other, and I just kind of... All right, now onto the cons of the Terminator X. It has a plastic non-potted case. It's not as robust, durable, waterproof, etc. So this is kind of a big one as I deal with oxygen sensors on a daily basis. But with the Terminator X, we can only run the Bosch LSU 4.9 sensor. And these sensors are very inexpensive. So it's good on the front side when you're placing an order for your EFI kit because it's going to save you a little bit of money. But they do fail far more frequently. So long term, it's actually far more expensive to buy multiple of these sensors as opposed to buying like an NTK sensor that the HP and Dominators can use. 